can you see it? The confidence, the power, the rank seven exceeds deck, my boy. We're getting in there with the black stone of legend to summon the black flare metal dragon, my boy. We're getting in there with the rank seven exceeds and I'm finally getting to show you the power of the red eyes tune engine, my boy. Let's take a look at the deck list. All right, my boys, we got a spicy deck list here because I know it's a lot of new cards that you haven't seen before. But if you checked out the stream last week, pretty much you saw me building this deck. Utilizing this card right here, number seven, Lucky Straight, definitely a boss monster, a win more card and not necessarily something that you need for this deck. But Lucky Straight can break games. I will show you that in this video, and you can also check it out on my stream, my boy. But it's not about Lucky Straight. Let's talk about the engine. So the first thing you need to learn about is the Black Stone of Legend. This card is really good. With the Black Stone of Legend, you can tribute it off to Special Summon from your deck. From your deck, my boy, a Red Eyes Toon Dragon. Now you're not gonna open with this all the time, and of course you don't wanna run three of these because these aren't dragon level one tuners like the blue eyes uh, stones. These are red eye stones, so they're a little weaker. You know, red eyes is supposed to be potential, blue eyes is supposed to be the power or some shit. So we don't get tuners, my boy. Our level is exceeds. That's where we're going, my boy, to the exceeds universe. So look. The next card we can use is Red Eyes Baby Dragon. Red Eyes Baby, is, when it's destroyed, can search your deck for any Red Eyes monster, put it onto the field, and you're gonna be using this. Red Eyes Toon Dragon, my boy. Red Eyes Toon Dragon can special summon a toon from the hand. And what, what toon do we want? Toon Dark Magician to either special summon a toon from the deck, Toon Barrel Dragon, or we want Toon Barrel Dragon, special summon from the hand, and use its effect to destroy one card on the field if we can get two heads off of his three coin toss flip. So this pretty much gives you an, a, a way to summon three to four monsters in one turn, do one or two XC summons in one turn, and potentially attack for game with one card destruction coming from Tomb Barrel Dragon. Combine that with MST, my boy, and your, uh, Red Eye Slash Dragon because you're rock still rocking the one Red Eyes Fusion, my boy. Put it all together, you're never gonna miss. The number one turn one opening play is Draco Sack. On our first turn, bringing out the Red Eyes Toon Dragon and then summoning out any other level seven. Going into Draco Sack gives us protection on the board by creating two tokens. With the tokens, the creatures, uh, the Draco Sack can't die, so these tokens sit on the board until Draco Sack is removed from the field. Obviously, Karma Cut will take care of this monster easily, but Karma Cut ain't what we worrying about, my boy. We worrying about playing Draco Sack on the first turn. We're using Red Eyes Baby. It's a Red Eyes name to use Red Eyes Fang with Chain, which shut down combos and steals opponents' monsters. Then on top of that, we're using Lord Gaia the Fierce Knight. Lord Gaia combined with this card, the Blackstone of Legend, can pretty much guarantee you uh, two level seven monsters summoned on the field so you can exceed summon unto your final combo, which means that you'll be able to put four exceeds, I mean four exceeds materials on the field and summon two exceeds monsters. So I got some spicy replays for you, my boy, showing off the power and the skill of the deck, especially a well-deserved Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon special win, my boy. That's bonus content, but I appreciate y'all for watching so much and I'll catch y'all in the next one. And as always, keep it dang. All right, my boys, this duel is gonna show off pretty much just a good operation of the deck. We're playing against Harpies, and as you can see, we pretty much have a really strong open in hand featuring the Black Stone of Legend, and honestly, the Red Eyes Baby Dragon, which I do enjoy having both of those cards 
in the first turn because red eyes baby dragon you can use the fang with chain and use its effect to steal monsters and if this monster is destroyed you can summon out a tune monster well sorry not two monster red eyes monster you'll be summoning red eyes tune to special summon this bad boy from your hand so it's pretty spicy uh but let's just go ahead and get right into it all right so i guess he's starting off harpy lady number one setting some back row now we've run three MST because, you know, obviously we want to make sure we get our combos through. So tribute to stone for the red eyes, toon dragon, toon dragon to summon toon barrel, toon barrel to flip its coins and a miss, a wonderful miss. And we're just going to set and pass. Now you definitely can exceed summon here and go into many different cards. You can definitely exceed summon. You could have went into Mega Fanta Beast Draco Sack. You could have went into Red Eyes Flare because you would have been able to use uh, the Fang with Chain as well. But why didn't I do that? Because basically this is a bigger threat to my opponent than one Exceeds monster. This monster can special summon something from my hand. He doesn't know what he's playing. For all he knows, this is another Tomb Barrel. And then Tomb Barrel can literally take a card from him at any moment. And I already have my Red Eyes Fang with set, check, set, Red Eyes Fang set. And it's basically check, like checkmate my boy, because this shit is about to clap his cheeks. So he's in a rough spot. So he's gonna go ahead and swallow his nest so that he can try to get in there um, and pop some back row. But I'm gonna fake him out by activating this Fang with Chain to see what he does. He uses the hunting ground to destroy my face down, which is, as you know, a Fang with Chain. And because he searched his deck for Elegant Egotist, this is the perfect time to strike with Fang with Chain. Says if Harpy's on the field, you can special summon a Harpy. So if he has no Harpy, I take his monster, then stop your entire turn, right? Wrong. Hysteric Party. But Hysteric Party requires you to discard a card, so it's not enough. It's just not enough. And when the card is destroyed, when the card that's equipped to the red eyes monster is destroyed, the attack goes to the original attack, which is 24, which he realizes, and that's just GG. So there you go. All right, boys, this next duel is gonna show off the power of Draco Sack. Now I did wanna point out that the skill that I have on is irrelevant. The skill that I like using will be revealed here in this final duel coming up, but not this one, my boy. But pretty much this skill is just a placeholder because I'm leveling up um, Emo Jaden here. So here we go. This is a good way to show you how I use Draco Sack um, for this replay. So this guy is one of those duelists that, you know, you're playing MST, but MST doesn't really matter because, you know, they're playing either one to minimal back row. And in this guy's particular case, there is one back row. I think it's like Floodgate or Treacherous or something ridiculous. Oh, Wall of D. So we pop the Wall of D. And because we're using Red Eyes Baby, we can set for the turn and pass. But this man is going to just, I guess, basically go into big synchro time for Vermilion, getting real clever to pop my back row, which I mean, cool. But he attacks into Red Eyes Baby, not expecting that. Search the deck for Red Eyes Tune. He doesn't know what's about to happen to him. Super equip the baby, special summon the tune barrel, flip its mighty coins. Well, boy, say goodnight. And Vermilion gets to add, but you know what? Add your life to the graveyard, my boy. We're gonna go ahead and exceed summon, my boy. Now, here comes the big exceeds for Mecha Phantom Beast, Draco Sack. Now, Draco Sack's disgusting because he can't kill Draco Sack. But I'm going to tribute my Draco Sack tokens for game. Nani, Grito, Grito, Draco Sack. Draco Sack's disgusting because he can tribute himself like an exiled force. All right, my boys. I think this is another good one where uh, pretty much um, I think I'm playing out of a brick. Yeah, I'm playing out of a brick. So. Clearly, this is one of those bricks where it's like definitely could do nothing if he came over there. But I top deck Red Eyes Baby, and as you can tell, Red Eyes Baby is putting in work. This this card is definitely an MVP at the deck. So Red Eyes Baby's on the field is destroyed. Search deck, Red Eyes Toon Dragon, of course. Let's top deck Barrel Dragon. Didn't top deck Barrel Dragon. So 
You know how that is, my boys. Hit him with the stone. Pop the stone. Search for the red eyes tune. Go for the XCs. Now, what's cool about it is, like, you can constantly keep going in the XCs because it's really easy to get a level 7 on the field. Um, bricking, of course, is always a danger, but as you can see, once you get going, you're going, my boy. So, Super Booty Team Hunger Force is here. Blue Eyes White Beat Stick. Guess what? Here's my chain. Don't you like my chain? But look, I am a fool. Because I super equipped my chain here thinking I could have gave this Blue Eyes White Beat Stick the mightiest of suck. But then I realized, oh no, this card only takes effect monsters. So right after that, he top decks my hide. So for him, he thinks this is lucky day because this is a dark monster. But this fool is about to get the super equipped suck in a minute. So he doesn't even know what's about to happen to him. First, he's going to take some damage from my mighty beast. And then I'll be calling back my tune. All right. Now, here we go again, my boy. Dado. And this time, we didn't get it. We did not get the ultimate. But what I love about this deck is that we run one red eyes fusion. And as long as you are careful with your vanilla red eyes and your Lord Gaia, the fierce knight, you're never going to miss. Come on out, my slash. Red eyes or slash. And then send the tune back at the black stone and kamikaze strike. Inferno Fire Blast. All right, my boys. So this one, I'm on fire. This is my rank up. And I think, uh, I don't know. I think maybe my fourth win streak or third win streak. So we're going in there at this point, my boy. And this is a very special spicy win. And it looks like we're coming off of another brick. Now, what's interesting is we MST into the treacherous, which is fantastic. But guess what? It's a red eyes mirror match, my boy. Here comes the red eyes fusion to bring out the dank red eyes slash. And he's doing it with the buster blader. So you know what kind of deck this is. So here, here you come, my boy. He's just going to wait because I'm guessing he was expecting drowning or something like that, which I definitely could understand. I have two back row, but all I had was the two chains and you know, if he had a swung in there, that would have been disgusting. That would have really hurt, but he did not. But you see, I topped at the Blackstone and I have these tune barrels in my hand. So you know what type of havoc I'm going to wreak, my boy. So we're going to tribute tune, tune, nani. Floodgate, my boy. Collapsed, my boy. And Wyvern. So I'm behind. And here's the red eyes. I'm really behind, my boys. This is for the rank up. This is for all the marbles, my boy. And I'm being beat down by a red eyes mirror match. Joey, the spirit of Joey has come up because I bastardized this deck. But Joey will be defeated, my boy. By adding the red stone to my hand, I sent back a tune. And by setting face down the red eyes baby, I'm ready for his assault. But he has strong wind dragon. You're not expecting that, my boy. Took life through defense damage. Red Eyes Tune to the field. Super equip. Super equip. Yes. In case you missed it, my boy. This Red Eyes or Slash was ready to destroy my Tune Beast. He was going to attack my precious Tune counterpart. But it's a good thing I had the Red Eyes Fang with Chain Face down. Because I was able to take this beast. You know why? Because this just takes the beast. I don't know. It takes the beast. Yeet. Give, give me. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> now, this is my favorite part, my boy. Because you can see where we have him. And you see what we need to do. So, let's go, my boy. Let us go forth and tempt fate. My tune summons and activates his effect. Coin of flip. Nani. I guess there's only one chance. XC Summon, number seven. Lucky Straight. Now, number seven Lucky Straight's effect is absolutely disgusting. Basically, I have three chances 
three chances to roll a seven and special summon Toon Barrel Dragon to the field and flip three coins for game. That's all Lucky Straight's doing. We're just trying to summon one level seven monster for free, blow him up, and swing in for game. Can we do it? Roll the dice. Five. Roll the dice. Nani. Two. Clap time. Say goodnight. Say goodnight. Congratulations. You've made it to the end of the video and you have owned a bonus clap. All right, my boys, we have a special bonus clap against a grit player. This is my special skill that I like to use ready for victory with this deck, my boy. Hit the like button if you're watching the bonus clap, my boy. But ready for victory, boost the attack of your monster. So let's get going, my boy. So first we're gonna black stone of legend into the red eyes tune. Red eyes tune to summon tune dark magician. Toon Dark Magician and Red Eyes Toon XC Shokan to form uh, Draco Sack. Draco Sack on the stack is going to put out two broken tokens. I'm going to set my Night Beam and pass. Now, this man's going to force me to draw. Of course, I'm going to take the Toon Barrel. He's banished my Red Eyes Toon. Now, I got a little scared right here when he put that level four monster on the field. But as soon as I saw him put the level three on the field, I was like, this dumb dumb's gonna try to do something real dumb dumb. Here he goes. He's hitting up his Synchro Shokan to summon Samurai, oh, Squire Saga. Squire Saga to pop my back row and attack because he did not read. Draco Stack says, as long as tokens are on the field, he cannot be destroyed by card effect or battle, meaning you gotta kill these tokens before you can kill him. And during my turn, I can tribute off him or these tokens to destroy cards on my opponent's side of the field. That's disgusting, but now it's my turn. Dodo, ready for victory. Now I can do ready for victory because both tokens on the field triggers my skill because they're both level three monsters. So I tribute the level three monsters to summon out Toon Dark Magician. Toon Dark Magician's effect to discard Toon Barrel, the special summon Toon Barrel from the deck. And with that, Toon Barrel activates its effect to destroy one card on the field, my boy. We're gonna go ahead and pop the back row and success. What price? The Wall of D. Now, you know he could have needed that, right? You know he could have used that against my Field of Beasts. Now, don't forget, I'm still ready for victory. So what does that mean? That means when a new Xyz monster joins the field, he's gonna receive a 500 point boost, meaning that the attack points of this newly Xyz summoned monster and Draco Sack will be enough to send this opponent to the graveyard with exactly 4,000 damage. Let us continue. Xyz Shokan into the red eyes flare metal dragon my boy the majesty then we're gonna go ahead and add the tune to the deck and add the stone to the hand collapse for game nani grito 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 now what an interesting position to be in. This person has one life point and there is a red eyes flare metal dragon on the field. Now, I don't know about you. I don't know about you, but this, this right here is exactly, exactly, exactly what I've been waiting for. Red eyes, flare metal dragon. Do your stuff, my boy. Well, boy! You see, you see? The Regeki break? He's left me with no choice. He's left me with no choice. So that's it, my boy. The red eyes, flare metal dragon is here. 
the power of the red eyes level seven rank seven exceeds engine my boy it's here my boy it's here to stay it's never going away my boy it's been released out into the ether and before you know it it will be mastered and be clapping at tier one my boy tier zero my boy so i'll catch you in the next one keep it dang